Without wasting your time, we are going to share Top 5 Best Electric Fishing Reel 2022. The product links are in the description and in first comment. The number 5 on the list is Daiwa Lil Leo Blitz. Daiwa Lil Leo Blitz, this electric fishing reel, has made it to the list of the 10 best electric fishing reels as it has some unique features. It comes with a right hand, retrieve selection and a gear, ratio of about this reel is ideal for saltwater and deep drop fishing. It makes it easy to reel. Enlarge this device is extremely easy to use you will be able to use the automatic stop without any hassle it is possible. To program this electric fishing reel to perform other tasks like jigging it has a built-in line counter that allows you to record the distance and depth to ensure accurate drops. You can use the stored information at a later stage to ensure consistent results. The four-bearing system of the fishing reel ensures smooth operation. The line guard is large to minimize knots and tangles. Verified purchase well I love these electric reels however, it should be stated in the description that this particular model has no English manual. I called the Diawa's tech support and they even said it has no English instructions. It also has no language settings on the reel as well so I'm a little disappointed. I really wanted to use the functions on the reel, but I'm thinking the learning curve is gonna be a little steep since I got to learn Japanese or get someone that does. The seller really should be getting low stars to explain this because Diawa makes great reels. I'm a little bummed to say the least I'm still gonna use it though but will save up for a Tanicum which is English and US compatible. It comes with alligator clips that are meant to clip to a battery but it's just a positive and a negative. You can remove the alligator clips and wire the red and black to any 12 volt plug you might have. My boat has downrigger plugs installed so I wired the reel to a downrigger male plug that fits my outlet and it works fine you just need to make sure whatever you're plugging it into is rated for the amperage that the reel pulls. The number 4 on the list is Shimano Plemio. Shimano Plemio durability and strength are the two most prominent features of the Shimano Plemio big game. Lightweight and with convenient adjustable drag settings you have complete control over how fast or slow you want to drag the line or the fish at the end of it. In addition the thermo included alerts you if the temperature of the line increased dramatically due to friction so you can avoid snapping the line and losing the big game. The inner parts of the plemio are made of stainless steel, we are talking about the ball bearings the axle and the lever. This ensures the quality of the Shimano and gives you confidence in your reel and its durability, even if the water conditions are less than ideal on the downside, it can be challenging to adjust the speed of the reel. The lever too can be unwieldy, especially if the fish is struggling at the end of the line. Took a chance and bought one and figured it out very quickly. Hold the zero down for a few seconds to set at after that it's automatic put in freeze pool. And let the line drop panned, it counts how much is out. Put in gear and start, retrieving with adjustable throttle. When the line gets to within 10 feet of the rod the reel stops automatically, and you finish the last 10 feet. Genius I bought a second one, changed my deep, water rock cod fishing forever. It counts in meters so you, multiply by, but maybe, there's a way to change that. No big deal though dot I looked everywhere for an affordable, electric reel. Diawa is too expensive. It's actually quite small compared to what I thought it would be. The only downfall is the instructions. All in Japanese I had to go to YouTube to figure it out. Works great for rock cod so far. We'll be using it for my kite rod for bluefin. The number 3 on the list is Bainax Cajun. Bainax Cajun, this Korean electric fishing reel has highly advanced features, including a quick slide clutch. It can easily detect changes in depth and respond to them with alacrity and speed. The reel's speed control is easy to use so that you can make the necessary changes during retrieval when we tested the Cajun. We were impressed with its responsiveness to unforeseen changes. We also like the construct which is high quality and ensures durability. It has seven ball bearings which ensure smooth operation. It requires a 12 volt battery to function and is portable thanks to the pouch. You can use the custom settings to perform tasks such as jigging. Settings too are easy to use. I got this for regular bottom fishing I had it loaded with 60 pounds in Visibrade the spool ran out at about yards and I had mono top shot added and got about feet for those looking for a manual it appears this model is the same 
as the so you can find the English manual on the internet if you look for the the reel is pretty light and I would not really recommend it for deep drop, but it is a big game, jigging reel and great for bottom fishing. I just wish it had a reel clamp, as you have to use the reel seat on the rod to hold it on. I use a car jump starter battery pack for it, and I really like it. I might purchase a few more. The drag on the reel has become very sticky, and there is a loud crack when the drag breaks free of the static friction. The motor still works like a champ though additionally, the typical baitcaster hand crank to come out of free spool is not working all the time anymore I don't use it anyway, and I like it. Better that way. The number 2 on the list is Shimano. Shimano, durability and strength are the two most prominent features of the Shimano. Plemio Big Game. Lightweight and with convenient adjustable drag settings, you have complete control over how fast or slow. You want to drag the line or the fish at the end of it. In addition, the thermo included alerts you if the temperature of the line increased dramatically due to friction so you can avoid snapping the line and losing. The big game the inner. Parts of the plemio are made of stainless steel we are talking. About the ball bearings, the axle and the lever. This ensures the quality of the Shimano and gives you confidence. And your real and its durability even if the water conditions are less than ideal. On the downside it can be challenging to adjust the speed of the reel. The lever too can be unwieldy, especially if the fish is struggling at the end of the line. The number one on the list is Daiwa Tanicum. Daiwa Tanicum, motor that powers this electric reel is one of the key features. That put the Daiwa Tanicum on the map, not only does it give the reel a lot of power, but it also offers other nifty features such as automatic drag thanks to the jog power lever you can operate this electric reel with just one hand. Made from an aluminum frame, the Seaborg weighs only pounds out of the box. It has a sealed ball bearings designed to protect against rust and erosion, and even though it's made in Japan the display language can easily be switched between English and Japanese. But for its small size, the Seaborg has a high price tag so if you're on a budget, you might look for other affordable. Electric reels the Daiwa Tanicum. Power assist reels join the Dendo lineup of deep drop and kite fishing reels with features that make power assist fishing easier than ever. Just connect the battery and lower your lure to the water's surface then press the reset button to zero the display and you're ready to start fishing with the reel, automatically measuring line, let out then advance the power lever to rewind the reel will automatically stop as your lure reaches the surface it's that simple, the versatile Tanicum makes deep drop fishing easier for anyone. Fight M on the handle and let the power assist do the drudgery of retrieving heavy sinkers from the depths when it's time to check your bait. To all my fellow fishermen, and Wamani have never written a bad review, but this company takes the cake, this is not the United States version, and if you want to use it to kite fish, don't bother to buy this 1.The level wind guide where the snap swivel goes through is not the same component as the US version and will not fit the standard kite snap swivel that needs to go through the guide please review pictures I let the company know this and they basically told me I would be responsible to make the change or repair and spend extra money my advice would be not to deal with this company or product if they are going to use different components than the US version it should be listed this is directly from Daiwa's website in the description of the product the versatile Tanicum makes deep drop fishing easier for anyone fight on the handle and let the power assist do the drudgery of retrieving heavy sinkers from the depths when it's time to check your bait.